966. Here we are, guys. Welcome back. I'm Mark Mulligan, and we are coming to you from Mulligan's Island, which is in San Carlos, Sonora, Mexico, just a few hours south of the Arizona border. What a beautiful day it is. Thank you, God, capital G, for that. We're going to have a good time tonight. Uh, we got a studio audience with us tonight. Hi, studio audience. <laughs> and one of, them, one of them's a birthday boy, but <laughs> I'm going to have a drink with him after the show. But in the meantime, I want you guys to go over to your fridge, grab yourselves something fun to drink, as you always do, and uh, let your friends know who are watching Boring Things Like News to flip on over here to uh, the Facebook page and join us because for the next hour and a half, we'll be singing songs that go with that scenery behind me which doesn't suck. Uh, we're at Pelican Beach in a condo that was uh, given to us for the show tonight by Seaside Realty. And it's just a beautiful condo. Um, I've stayed here in this, in this building many times. And wow, it's incredible. Uh, if you want any information about this place, make sure you shoot us a note and we'll hook you up with Seaside Realty. And appreciate them hooking us up with this for the show. We got Pablo and Anais back. I haven't sung for you guys since um, right before Christmas. So it's good to be back here again. Um, if you can share this on your page, boy, that's a huge help to us. And uh, I see we get the ball rolling here. Rudy B, of course, wrote and performs our theme song from Mulligan's Island. I say we kick it off with Rudy B. Take it away, Rudy. Let's make our way down to Mexico Where we can meet the friends we know White sand, warm sun, and H2O It's time for us to get back to laid back Try a different beer from our favorite six pack This crazy world says, come on, let's go It's time for the music man A coastal kid with guitar in hand Even bad days are good here on the island Giving us a place where we can Talk to each other fan to fan Uncharted courses crossing our paths It's our kind of people And our kind of place Down in the tropics It's a Mexican hideaway Life in this old beach town Turns a frown upside down We all be smiling Here on Mulligan's Island It's the right place and the right time To be south of the border again This is the day we get to listen in We don't sing no blues anymore We kick off our shoes at our front door Full of wide-eyed wonder as the waves roll in It's time for the music man A coastal kid with guitar in hand Even bad days are good here on the island Giving us a place where we can Talk to each other fan to fan Uncharted courses crossing our paths It's our kind of people And our kind of place Down in the tropics A Mexican hideaway Life in this old beach town Turns a frown upside down We all be smiling Here on Mulligan's Island I'll be smiling 
here on Mulligan's Island. Welcome back, everybody. It is so good to be back with you on a Monday night coming to you from Mexico. Uh, appreciate you all joining us. Something tells me we're going to have fun tonight. Am I right, studio audience? And studio audience, what do you guys think about being in Mexico tonight? Well, if you're at home watching and you're currently shivering, we're going to warm things up for you. With a few songs and a few pictures and a few videos from south of the border. I can hear the sound of music coming across that border line tonight. And I can feel the touch of a young girl gently take my hand underneath the moonlight. Soft refrains on a Spanish guitar carry me away. A voice is calling as I close my eyes. I think I hear her say, Mexico. You've been there on my mind for a long, long time, and I know that I just can't stay away, Mexico. Like warm white sand in the palm of my hand, gotta go, Mexico. Been a while, but does she remember? Is she still waiting there for me? And does she ever think about those hot summer nights down by the sea? Distant highways and dusty old roads, you got me crossing the line. Lead me down to where nobody knows. Take me back in time, Mexico. You're the one that I love and I can't get enough, Mexico. But you're another world away, Mexico. Those clear blue skies and big brown eyes gotta go, Mexico. I can feel that wind begin to blow. Every time I hear that sound, I know. Help me out, guys. Mexico. You've been there on my mind for a long, long time. And I know that I just can't stay away. Mexico. Like warm white sand in the palm of my hand. Gotta go. And I'll be coming back to stay. Mexico, you're the one that I love and I can't get enough, Mexico, but you're another world away, Mexico, those clear blue skies and big brown eyes gotta go, Mexico. spot to be today welcome to you from wherever you are joining us I, I hear it's getting a little nippy in some parts of the United States and Canada right now am I right so uh, yeah well I'll tell you what I, I think we got to send one out for you guys because I know a whole bunch of you guys right now are wondering where'd my summer go Every year around this time, Labor Day comes and goes, and I find that my heart starts sinking like the September sun, and I tell myself, oh no, I swear the month of May was only yesterday, next thing I know, it's where my summer goes. Stays down on the shore Toes in the sand Sun on my skin Just kicking back on the coast And now the kids are back in school again 
And reality is sure closing in The days are getting long The nights are getting long And the nights will soon be cold Hey, where'd my summer go? Now a lot of folks Need a break from the heat Call me crazy Bring on a hundred one degrees I'd rather bake in the sun Than put a sweater on When it's cold I just can't chill But October's on the way Need one more lazy day Somebody tell me where'd my summer go Can't life move a little more slow Can't warm June weather last forever Can't autumn be postponed I wish these really long days would last But the sun's going down too fast Somebody stop it before it disappears Leaving me all alone Wondering where'd my summer go They're breaking out sweatshirts and putting on jeans But I still got my swimming suit on It actually is on, it's on underneath these shorts I'm taking one last dip Then guess I gotta let go Oh no, where'd my summer go? Come on, say it isn't so I miss those UV rays on hot July days Don't tell me that's all she wrote but according to the weatherman, won't be long till we lose these tents. So what do you say, guys? Just one more time, you meet me down on the shore before we say, "Wet my summer go, wet my summer go, wet my summer go, wet my summer go." Don't want to say when my summer go. I, I know it feels really strange to sing that song in shorts and a short sleeve shirt. Yeah, it, it, there's a whole bunch of people out there who are not feeling the least bit sorry for me because I might have to put a sweatshirt on in a few hours. Sorry, guys. That's just the way it is here in San Carlos. So I actually don't live in San Carlos. I live around the bend from here, between here and the city of Wymus, kind of near a place called Miramar. And uh, I, I'm blessed because I get this neat drive here every day and a neat drive home. And in fact, I'll show it to you right now. So I'm on the back road heading from Miramar to San Carlos. And it's about a 16, 17 kilometer drive. But boy, is it scenic. You got Miramar, Bacochibampo Bay off to the left. And then really makes this drive special as you're heading towards San Carlos is when you come over this hill you see San Carlos off in the distance. Boy, is it beautiful. Back on That sure beats, beats being stuck at a red light in a whole bunch of traffic. That drive is pretty neat. Uh, it's such a scenic coastal road that goes from San Carlos to Miramar. Hope you get down here sometime and take it and visit me over in my neighborhood. I'll come out and visit you while you're staying here in San Carlos. So I mentioned to you about this weather that we're having. I mean, this is kind of nice right now, isn't it? Uh, so let's throw some sunshine into another song. I'll take the sunshine any day. That looks 
look upon your face is not a smile. And I don't think nice to see you's on your mind. Is it safe to say the end is just beginning? I may be dumb, but I ain't blind. So divide up all the things we own, we'll go our separate ways. What else can I say? I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. I'll take the good times, you take the pain. There's nothing left between us and there's no one left to blame. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. I guess you and I should have never been together. How we got this far, I'll never know. Cause the things that make me happy drive you crazy. And the love down in your heart died long ago. So you take your things, I'll take mine, if that's how it's gotta be. That's all right with me. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. I'll take the good times, you take the pain. There's nothing left between us, and there's no one left to blame. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. So divide up all the things we own, we'll go our separate ways. What else can I say? Help me out, guys. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. I'll take the sometimes, you take the pain. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. I'll take the good times, you take the pain. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. I'll take the good times, you take the pain. There's nothing left between us and there's no one left to blame. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. There's nothing left between us and there's no one left to blame. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. I'll take the sunshine, you take the rain. Thank you very much, everybody. Well, good place to grab some sunshine is down the beach from here. I, I really love it down on Playa San Francisco, San Francisco Beach. How about if we take you there right now, here in San Carlos to one of my favorite beaches. We're gonna go there in one second. <laughs> my sound lady saying, say something. Hi everyone, how you doing? doing Hope everybody has a drink in their hand and that you're enjoying the show. Don't forget if you can share this on your Facebook page, huge help to us. And if you wanna just let somebody know uh, that we're here having a good time, We'd love to get them on over here on Mulligan's Island and have them join us. Uh, so, while I'm thinking of things to say here, this beach we're going to show you is in San Carlos. However, in a little while, uh, in just a few songs, I'm going to take you down further south to a place called Lo de Marcos, uh, not far from where I spent part of my time during the pandemic with the family, and one of our good friends, Susan King, a uh, steel pan player from, from San Carlos. She just moved down that way, and so we thought, well, shoot, we'd kind of show you where she's hanging out these days and uh, take you down to Lo de Marcos. See, no puedes no está bien. Podemos después. Okay. All right. I'll tell you what. Why don't I do this? Well, well, we figure out what's going on in that video. Hey, I want you to imagine this really cool video of this beach called Playa San Francisco. You see that? Now, does not look cool in your head? Is this show great or what? <laughs> wow. I mean, we do videos just like you're thinking them. All right. So, tell you what. Um, we'll, we'll come up with that video. Don't worry, An Anais won't be fired. I'll be fired before she will. I'll give you guys a new song. Um, I'm, I've been up in Hermosillo, which is about an hour from here, and I've been working on the new album. Usually I record in Nashville, but uh, this album I'm doing with my band called Six and a Half Mexicans. And boy, it's it going to be a really, really fun album. We've got trumpets and accordions and violins and sombreros. we got it all on this next CD. It's going to be kind of neat. But this is a song off it right here. And uh, hope you enjoy. Is it the only video you know why? Oh no, I need to go down. And once Anaïs's mouse gets charged, we can show you the video, folks. 
I want to welcome you to the big time. Last time I went to saw Bruce Springsteen live, the entire show stopped when the mouse needed to be recharged. Just so you don't think I'm small time. All right, all right, here we go. Brand new song for you. And it feels so good to get my feet back in the sand. It's like I finally am me again. Nickels, dimes, and dollar signs led this soul astray. So much for that first million, least I can say that it feels so good. That sunshine on my skin, it's like I finally am me again. All it took was one look at that stranger in the mirror. That's when it hit me, I'm out of here. Funny I'd forgotten about the guy I used to be Till I got out of that city And back down to the sea Now it feels so good Yeah, it feels so good Man, it feels so good To get my feet back in the sand Sunshine on my skin Cold one in my hand me again. Thank God I finally am me again. For so long I've longed to be me again. Thank God I finally am New song. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I hope you guys are going to enjoy the upcoming album. I'm hoping to get that sucker out of the next six weeks, eight weeks or so. And uh, I'm excited about it. I'm equally excited about the fact that the mouse has been recharged, ladies and gentlemen. We, we have an active mouse. So let's see that video that you were thinking in your head. Let's see if the video you're about to see is 10% as good as the one you were imagining in your head. Take it away. You got to play some music. All right, here we go. <laughs> this is one of my favorite beaches in San Carlos. It's called San Francisco Beach. In this part of San Carlos, you really feel away from everything. There's a couple of condo complexes. That's kind of me, this Pilar right there, one of the original uh, condo complexes in San Carlos. And just the other side of it is Bahia Delphine. Very popular spot for families. You got the beautiful Tetakawi landmark out there. Awesome sunsets to the west. Just offshore, you got an island. You can kayak out there. There's good fishing just beyond that island. Off that way, you got Miramar and the Dolphinarium. And then around what seems like this endless beach here is a beautiful estuary. All kinds of birds, great kayaking. You really feel like you're away from everything here on San Francisco Beach, even though you're only just a few minutes drive from town. But it sure is a neat beach to walk. Oftentimes, you have it all to yourself. San Francisco Beach.
So when you got a view like that, even with technical difficulties, you still got to be smiling. Am I right, guys? The economy has got you down. Is it me? Or is that a frown? That upside down smile never looked good on you. Down in the tropics, out on the island, a crazy man says, I be smiling. These days, what else you gonna do? But listen to the crazy man singing this song for you. I got the sea and the shore outside my door. Slap me if I ever complain. Good morning from the island. The sun is shining and I be smiling today. Bad news is getting old. The weather's hot, but the world is cold. Ain't it time that we all had a little fun? Today's music is in the crapper. Techno pop and gangster rappers. Those nasty old thugs ain't ever gonna bring me down. With the sea and the shore outside my door. Slap me if I ever complain. Good morning from the island, the sun is shining, and I'd be smiling today. We got the sea and the shore, outside my door, slap me if I ever complain. Good morning from the island, the sun is shining, and I'd be smiling today. I'm taking a poll, how many of you guys out watching the show are smiling today? This little ditty don't make sense, but I don't care, just want to dance. So take my hand, let's groove till the sun goes down. It's a crazy old world, but I think I'll stick around. With the sea and the shore outside my door, slap me if I ever complain. Good morning from the island, the sun is shining, and I be smiling today. Help us out at home, the sea and the shore, outside my door, slap me if I ever complain. Good morning from the island, the sun is shining, and I be smiling. You guys, the sea and the shore, outside my door, slap me if I ever complain. Good morning from the island, the sun is shining, and I be smiling one more time. The sea and the shore, outside my door, slap me if I ever complain. Good morning from the island, the sun is shining, and I be smiling today. Good morning from the island, the sun is shining, and I be smiling today. Mulligan's Island, the sun is shining, and I be smiling today. Well, I'm not the only one smiling around here. Some friends of mine here in St. Carlos were just out on the boat for this weekly beer can race that they do there. So I want to say hello to uh, Tom and Patty Legrelius who watched this show. Tom, I know you're up in California. You had to go back and do that work thing. We don't like to use language like that on the show, but... Uh, sorry, we had to. And uh, Patty, though, is down here spending all the time's money. I mean, she's down here having a good time in San Carlos. And um, some of the friends of theirs went out, like Kelly and Scott and Greg. They were all out on the boat here. Let's head out on that water with them for just a couple of seconds. How are we doing, folks? We're doing awesome. We're doing awesome. Fabulous. Fabulous. Are we doing great? We are doing awesome. Thank are we going to win this effort. race? Oh, there's a can of beer in it for you, buddy. Oh, man, we're going to win this race. <laughs> yeah. There's a guy. There is one guy behind us. Awesome. There's another guy behind us. There's another guy behind us. Yeah, there's a unfortunately, in front of you. there's a couple guys ahead of us. That looks kind of fun to me. I think we all need to head out right now on a little boat on the water. What do you think?
little boat on the water Big boat in the yard Sitting up on a trailer Bound with tie downs and a tarp Always one thing or another Keeps that hole from getting wet Now summer's halfway over She still ain't been out there yet Little boats in the water Big boats in the yard Flashy and extravagant From bow to stern With a cocky grin he christened her Money to burn But problem after problem Makes a boat mechanic rich Didn't take very long till he said Man, I wish I had a little boat in the water Not this big boat in the yard he hears a single outboard chugging While his twins won't even start Never could break that addiction Always had to have more So much for all that bragging Saying, what's money for? Little boats in the water Big boats in the yard She said, I met my man When she laid eyes on that craft the house, the cars, the money. She said, I can do that. Till reality caught up with them and everything went south. With a wake of debt behind them, she said, you work it out. Now little boat's in the water, bouncing across the bay. That sea of bills he's drowning in gets deeper every day. His lawyer's talking options and it's looking pretty grim. Stares out his office window and remembers when he had a little boat in the water. Not this big boat in the yard. Somewhere he got sucked in. Now he just wants out. Cause bigger don't mean better Sometimes enough's enough Forget that stupid joke About he who dies with the most stuff Just keep a little boat in the water Some fancy yacht no need to bother Just keep a little boat in the water If it's an inflatable raft, who cares? You're getting wet. It's a lot of fun. All right, boy, do we have some good restaurants in this town studio audience? We really do. One thing, one thing that's really interesting about San Carlos, we're talking about a town that doesn't even have a stoplight. And I'm not exaggerating. We literally don't have one. We actually debated it several years ago. It was a huge controversy. Uh, and, and, and it lost 51-49, as everything does these days. Even that was split. There are people who don't speak to each other anymore over the stoplight. I'm kidding you. I'm kidding you. But anyway, um, but for a town without a stoplight, to have 40, 45, I think, different places you can eat just in this area. Uh, I mean, you got from your smallest hot dog stands and taco stands to really, really great restaurants. One of them that's really popular that I hadn't been to until I shot this video is called La Catrina. And it's just down the street that way from here. We thought we'd take you over there right now to check it out and have a bite with us. Well, Elsa and I have heard so much about this place called La Catrina. We've never been here before. We thought we'd try it out for lunch today. Now, the first thing you notice when you walk in La Catrina is just the personality. The Mexican artwork in here is just incredible. It's on the walls, it's on the tables. It just really feels authentic. The side patio here is just really a relaxing place to enjoy a meal. Really nice breakfast menu they offer.
This is Jorge, and he is the owner of La Catrina. Hi, Jorge. Hi, Mark. Hey, it, what a beautiful place you have here. How long have you been here? Thank you, Mark. I've been here almost eight months. Eight months now. I've yeah. heard awesome things about this from a lot of people. Wow, this looks really good. Jorge, what do we have here? We have a tuna tostada with strawberry uh, with a black salsa. It's wow. really good. It's one of the best things yeah. we have. It. That looks have really it. good. I've never seen a tuna, a tuna tostada with cranberries okay. before. You should come and try and see it. <laughs> really unique. How delicious is this? Yeah. Now, Elsa, I know you were hungry today. What did you decide to get? Well, I haven't had any breakfast yet, so um, I decided to have uh, chilaquiles uh, covered with green creamy salsa. Oh yeah. Uh, eggs and beans. Eggs and beans. Yeah. I know this is uh, this uh, sauce is made by uh, George's wife. Yeah, it's very different. Yeah, good. Well, as for me, I decided to get the agua chili scallops. Would it really look good? And these come with the black sauce. How's the food, Elsa? Delicious. Wow, the tuna tostada is really incredible. Boy, our meals here in La Catrina were fantastic. Uh, really unique food, the green sauce on Elsa's uh, chilaquiles that Jorge's wife made, really, really tasty. I've never had a tuna tostada covered with cranberries before. What a unique touch, really, really delicious. And of course, the agua chili um, scallops, they were great too. And for a place this unique, you'd be surprised. The prices are really reasonable. That big tuna tostada I had covered with cranberries. Really, really good, really filling. It's just over $3. The scallops I had, just over $10. The coconut shrimp, that's less than $9. This quality in the United States or Canada would cost you a lot more than that. So next time you're visiting San Carlos, if you want to get just a great meal, make sure you give this place a shot. It's called La Catrina. Really recommend it. You're going to love it. Well, I'm sorry, folks. Apparently our show is over. The security guard just showed up to kick me off the stage. It's been really fun singing for you. I know she looks, yeah, looks really tough, doesn't she? This is, this is Karen Stewart. And remember at the beginning of the show, I told you that uh, Seaside Realty has lent us this beautiful condo and this stage here, as they've done so many times for our Facebook Live shows. And uh, lo and behold, Karen Stewart from Seaside Realty just walked in the door, and I thought I'd let you to meet this person to see she's not fictional, she's real. Karen, say hello to your people. Hello, hello. I am real, and I am here, and I'm so happy to see so many of you listening to Mark's program, or his we're so happy that he's been able to stay online for so long, and we just can't live without him. Thank you. Go and on. so <laughs> I'm, I'm just thrilled that he will use our, our condos. Um, he's always welcome, and he and his family stay here a lot, and we love to have him here. And we'd love to have you here. So anytime you need a place to stay in San Carlos, just give us a call. You got it. You know what's cool is I know that uh, a couple of people, who have stayed in this condo or watching tonight. Uh, Pete and Kathy Ferrali, hello to you guys. You've stayed here at Pelican Beach. Turk Sims over in West Texas, you came down with your sister and uh, had a great time down here. Dave and Leanne, I know you guys are watching tonight. You guys came and stayed here. Um, it's, uh, there's been a bunch of you guys. And Mary Alice Grinder, who's watching us from Rocky Point tonight, she won the condo. The condo stay here and is going to be coming down and staying here soon too. So uh, anyway, thank you, Karen, for giving us such a cool stage. Everyone give a big round of applause. Your homework project is to go buy a home from Seaside Realty. Minimum purchase, $899,000. You can even buy a vacant lot. Okay, that's okay. Anyway, uh, got a request from Sharon in our front row here. She's within bottle throwing distance, so I'm going to play her request. 
Like many people in this town, she's turning into Mark Mulligan's song titles. Which isn't always good. I have a song called Drinking Mets Go Dry. <laughs> but this one's called First World Refugee. We got a few of those in this crowd tonight. up and he looks out at the ocean a big old lazy sun paints the morning sky somewhere off the coast of Hispaniola he gently rubs the sleep out of his eyes he's on the third year of a two week long vacation Wasted too many years working too much overtime Just to surround himself with stuff he never needed Till he hopped on board that boat and waved goodbye Just the other day he took that cell phone And tossed it out in the Caribbean Sea they call him a first world refugee Far away from the land of the free He's got tropical sunshine running through his blood Now Uncle Sam forgot his name And he's never going back again Cause he's finally found a place to call his home Reaches down below and he grabs that old spear gun. There's an ocean full of fish are calling out his name. Jump overboard and he'll swim out toward the island. Catch his lunch and come back home again. Now the folks up north say he must be smoking something. But they don't know what it is that gets him high You see there's something in these blue and emerald waters Gives him a buzz that money just can't buy So he heads that sailboat straight into the sunset Hey, there's no place on this earth he'd rather be First world refugee Far away from the land of the free He's got tropical sunshine Running through his blood Now Uncle Sam forgot his name And he's never going back again Cause he's finally found a place To call his home Just like Sharon and David thought they could leave us for a couple of years, but it didn't quite work out, did it? They came right back, and I don't think they're leaving this time. Now, life is good on this side of the sandbar. Ain't no doubt about it. This is where he's born to be. He's just a first world refugee. Far away from the land of the free. He's got tropical sunshine running through his blood. Now Uncle Sam forgot his name, and he's never going back again. Cause he's finally found a place to call his own. Oh, he's finally found a place to call his own. I know some people that's happened to. <laughs> you know what would have sounded really cool on that next, uh, on that last song it was Steel Pan. Well, see, we were blessed in this town to have a steel pan player named Susan King. Very popular. In fact, uh, she was here for, I think, six and a half years. Funny thing was, I remember talking to her before she ever moved here. Years and years ago in Texas, uh, I was doing a gig out there and met her out there. And she thought I was absolutely nuts for living in Mexico. She did. Thought I was insane. Next thing I knew, she was living here. And 
Now she's gone even further south. She's down in Lo de Marcos, which is down in Nayarit. And we're going we're gonna to head down there and check in on Susan in just a few minutes. But uh, we did send her off with a, a packed house send-off here at La Palapa Griega. Uh, I was playing guitar, and we had Susan on the steel pan. And let's just check out a quick little clip from that night. That was a lot of fun. <laughs> On a dark desert highway, cool wind in my hair, warm smell of colitas rising up through the air. Up ahead in the distance, I saw a shimmering light. Heavy in my sight grew thin, I had to stay for the night. There she stood in the doorway, I heard the mission. Thinking to myself, this could be heaven and this could be heaven. Then she lit up the kingdom. Well, thank you to everybody who came to La Palapa Griega that night and uh, and sang along with Susan and me. In fact, I'm going to be at La Palapa Griega tomorrow night. Uh, anybody who's here in San Carlos, love to see you there. I'm there on Tuesday nights. And uh, if you got to put up with the music to get half price heroes and 40 peso marks, okay? That's the deal. But anyway. We're going we're gonna to head on down for the next few songs to where Susan King is, a little further south. You've been seeing all pictures of San Carlos. And by the way, great job to all you photographers. These pictures that you guys are looking at, the ones that I didn't take or Elsa, um, we got a lot of those labeled, and those are you guys sending those in. Amazing job by you guys. Um, so we're going to head down and, uh, and show you now a little further south where Susan King is. She's in this place called Lo de Marcos, L-E-O-L-O. And then another space, then D-E, then my name, Marcos. And it's about 25 minutes south of the little town that I spent some time in called Los Ayala. And uh, we'll show you some pictures along with the song here as we wander on down there with a Rob Mel song. And uh, we're going we're gonna to visit Susan in just a few. So let's get in the mood to Don't It Make You Wander. And Rob Mel watching us up in the Northwest. Hello, buddy. <laughs> I cannot wait till our upcoming show. Yeah, we're going to do one. Some of my friends have told me that I seem to lack ambition. Though I try to explain that I search for the meaning of life when I'm deep sea fishing. All they say I really need is a good sense of direction. So I pulled out the morning paper. And I opened up the travel section and I said, North, South, East, West, which direction do you think is best? Don't tell me I don't know where I'm going. My ticket says anywhere the wind is blowing. Don't it make you wander? Don't it make you wander? Do you ever wonder? I wonder sometimes. Don't it make you wonder? I was sitting at home one night watching the Outdoor Channel. You know I can't get excited about going someplace if I have to wear something flannel. Next was a show about tropic beaches. I like what I'm seeing. Next thing I know, I find myself on a plane to the Caribbean, and I said, fly, sail, sail, fly, blue of the sea, blue of the sky, don't tell me I don't know where I'm going. I got a current passport and a Swiss Army knife. Don't it make you wonder? Don't it make you wonder? ever wonder, I wonder sometimes, don't it make you wonder, dreamers often see things that some folks never see, but they often blur the line between fact and fantasy, now poets often ponder, but they seldom count the cost, just because I wander, doesn't mean I'm lost. Don't it make you want 
wonder. Ooh, oh. Come on, guys. Don't it make you wonder? Ooh, oh. Do you ever wonder? I wonder sometimes. Don't it make you wonder? Ooh, oh. Don't it make you wonder? wonder I wonder I wonder sometimes don't it make you wonder don't it make you wonder don't it make you wonder all right well now that we've wandered down to the state of Nayarit which is two states south here you got Sonora where we are then you cross the border into Sinaloa and then you drive real fast to get through Sinaloa. <laughs> and you end up in the state of Nayarit. And uh, let's go down now to that little town that Susan King is hanging out in. Uh, it's called Lo de Marcos. And we'll show you some video that uh, Elsa and I shot when we were down there uh, on our state down there in Los Ayala. <laughs> about 15 minutes south of the town that we live in, Los Ayala, in a place called Lo de Marcos. And it's a beautiful day down here, as you guys can see. And even more beautiful now that we got margaritas with us. Uh, this is a neat beach town. We've been down here before with my brother. And in fact, we're sitting outside a restaurant right now called Olivia's. And the waves are a little bit bigger here. Further down the beach, there's people surfing. Um, there's people boogie boarding. So it's a little bit different scene than Los Ayala. But the beach, it's just incredible. It seems to go on forever. And it's just a beautiful view, too. So. Salud. Salud, everybody. Wow, kind of neat down there, isn't it? Just, you know, it, what's interesting about this country, people don't realize this, you know, it takes, takes me four and a half days to drive across this country. And people don't realize this is 32 states here. And so that's just, you know, two states further south of us, and it's a totally different landscape. People hear the word desert, and they think of barren desert. Well, you've seen the pictures of San Carlos. It's lush, it's beautiful. It's these uh, saguaro cactuses and reddish mountains that go right down to the ocean. Uh, and then you've got Nayarit, which is like a different country, very tropical. Um, so lots of different variety here in Mexico. Um, so tell you what, wherever you go, I think you'll be able to relate to this next song. I've kind of learned in life that most places named after saints are, are, are the kind of places I like to be. Um, although I don't think I'd really want to be in St. Paul, Minnesota right now. Just I might wait till May, June. Sorry about that, John and Carol Sherwin. I know you're watching, but I think you agree with me right now. Beach chair and a blender, Coronas and copper tone. Fresh lobster and coconut shrimp, I can taste it on my tongue. But I wake up from my daydream, and the boss is on my case. Something I did sure made him mad. And I need a good day real bad. Blame it on the wind chill. Or maybe it's the rain Pull me out of my cubicle And put me on a plane All attitude adjustments Exactly what I need No shoes, no shirt required Someplace warm, I can chill out for a while St. Martin's, St. John's, or St. Pete Hotter than hell is cool with me. St. Lucia or St. Carlos, I don't care. Send me down to St. Anywhere. A beach bar in Mexico, a boat down in Belize. 
A puddle jump to paradise, the Caribbean or the Keys. I've used up all my sick days, so I'm calling in dead. I could get canned, but I don't care. I've had it up to here, I'm going down there. Where? Waking up at the crack of noon means your day has just begun. Where the ice in my glass barely lasts till I pour me another one. Where seagulls and pelicans chase the sun across the sky. I'll be watching as some sailboat disappears. On just another day, it ain't anywhere. Need a bright and breezy, really lazy day in the tropical sun. So pick a saint and point me toward the sea. I'm tearing off my necktie and dreaming about a Mai Tai. So close your eyes and come along with me. Cause girl, we ought to be St. Mark's, St. John's, or St. Bart's. Halfway there, wondering where you are. San Lucia or San Carlos, I don't care. Send me down to Saint anywhere. They can have Saint Paul, I'll take Saint Pete. So adios, boss, I'm out of here. Destination Saint anywhere. Catch you there, Saint Anywhere. I'll catch you all there, Saint Anywhere. <laughs> Thank you. Well, let, let's do a video that kind of goes with a song like that. Let's head on back down to Lo de Marcos and see what's on the dinner menu. No better way to celebrate the sunset down here in Lo de Marcos than with great food. I've got fish here that's stuffed with shrimp and it's covered with the bechamel sauce and uh, some great guacamole. Jose, what do you have there? Chile relleno. Chile relleno. Awesome, man. And Marisol, how about you? Quesadillas. Quesadillas, her favorite dish. It's a beautiful night. Yes. Yeah. There goes the sun. All right. Wow, it was kind of good, doesn't it? Well, we got to do a song that goes with that sunset we were just looking at there. So let's let's wash that sunset down with the Corona. And this one goes out for Leslie right here. Leslie is uh, in our studio audience, and she and Brad and friends are joining us here from uh, from Boise. Welcome to you guys. Yeah. Corona sunset and margarita moon. Spanish guitar, serenade the sky with a tune. Waves kissing the shore. And time for just one more Corona sunset and margarita moon. They say down here crazy things can happen. This past week, we're living proof. A mixed up reservation, a casual hello. A couple drinks and next thing we knew it was Corona sunsets and margarita moons. Suddenly, mañana's coming way too soon. Wish this night could somehow last Instead of fading away so fast Like Corona sunsets And margarita moon Our footprints in the sand Will soon be washed away As echoes of tonight fade with the breeze 
You'll be back in your world And I'll be back in mine Looking back on distant memories Sails out on the sea Silhouettes of you and me And Corona sunsets Now your boarding pass is printed And your bags are packed Just like that Reality's closing in But this evening sky has got me Thinking crazy thoughts Perhaps this story doesn't end with this corona sunset and margarita moon is it me or are you kind of wondering too will these memories disappear or lead us both back here to corona sunsets and margarita moons will the salt air on the breeze Again, find you and me under Corona sunsets. I know I'll never forget Corona sunsets and Margarita Moon. Thank you for the request, Leslie. Thank you very much for that. You know what? I told you guys we were going to check in on Susan King, who just got down to Lodi Marcos uh, just a little while ago. So she's on a scouting mission for us down there to let us know how that place is. So let's say hi to Susan King. Hey, Mark. Susan. We're at Olivia's having a margarita and waiting for the sun to set. I'm actually here with two of your other friends. Watch this. Hey, Becky. Hi, Mark. <laughs> hey, Pete. Hola, Mark. Yep. We're waiting for this margarita. It hadn't shown up yet, but it will. Something tells me Susan King is having fun down there, and I know she's watching tonight, so everybody make sure in your comments to say hello to Susan King. And, uh, and actually, uh, another person watching from down at Lode Marcos, they haven't met yet. There's another fr uh, friend who watched the show, Susan Broadfoot from North Carolina. I know that you're down there, and you two need to meet because you both have dogs. You love to walk those dogs on the beach, and I hope you meet the two Susans, uh, both Mooligans Hooligans from the... Uh, from the Monday show, and here they are living in the same little tiny beach town. So I hope they meet at some point uh, here very soon. Well, um, I say we do wash this down with a cold Pacifico. What do you think? Blue water, sunny skies. Another day in paradise. It wasn't long ago we said goodbye. I ended up down here. Now who's to blame? I can't recall. But who cares, it doesn't matter at all Cause I'm a world away from you Sucking down an ice cold beer But things never quite work out like I planned 
What you doing back on my mind again? Sand dollars and pesos A slight buzz and a sunburn nose It ain't much but it's something to show For all this wasted time I thought the beaches and the ocean view Were all I needed to get over you The sun is shining like tequila gold But I'm Pacific oh blue I can tell you about the fun I've had At first it really wasn't all that bad The weather's nice and the people are too So how could I complain? But last night when I was all alone I left a message at the sound of a tone And said, honey, won't you pick up the phone Before I go insane You cut me off and you left me hanging on the line Pulled out a glass and I chased you off my mind Sand dollars and pesos Slight buzz and a sunburned nose It ain't much but it's something to show For all this wasted time I thought the beaches and the ocean view Were all I needed to get over you The sun is shining like tequila gold But I'm Pacific blue. Anyone out there drinking a Pacifico tonight? Sand dollars and pesos A slight buzz and a sunburned nose It ain't much but it's something to show For all this wasted time I thought the beaches and the ocean view Were all I needed to get over you The sun is shining like tequila gold But I'm Pacific blue I thought the beaches and the ocean view were all I needed to get over you. The sun is shining like tequila gold, but I'm Pacific old blue. The sun is shining like tequila gold, but I'm Pacific old blue. Well, thank you. Well. We're going to head back down to that beach in Lo de Marcos, and I'm, I'm going to give you a little lesson in Mexican beer brands. One of the things we have noticed down here is that people drink different beer than they do up in Sonora, where my family and I live. For example, in Guaymas, uh, the fishermen, they all drink Tecate. I don't think you would catch a Sonoran fisherman ever drinking a Corona. But down here... In the village we live in, and all over Nayarit, it seems to be Corona, a Corona light. Uh, then the state right in the middle of Nayarit and Sonora is Sinaloa. And they make the beer that I'm drinking right now, called Pacifico. Salud, everybody. Here's your beer lesson for today. If one thing about them, they're all good. So, I have just been alerted by my studio audience of Mexico's first supply chain emergency. Oh, oh. Apparently, we're, we're out of Pacifico. Yeah. San Carlos has drunk Mexico dry of, of Pacifico. Good job, San Carlos. Yeah. So, you know, during the pandemic, uh, I, I couldn't believe they actually did this in this country without another revolution. But, but they, they actually cut off booze sales. Do you remember that for a while? And Mexico went dry for, for like six weeks. I didn't think the country was capable of it. <laughs> And, and I love the video. The first video I saw when, they, when the, up in Hermosillo, they, they started allowing some place to get beer again. And the first Tecate truck that pulled into an Oxo market, that's like our Circle K. And there was a crowd of people out there celebrating. like they, you know, It was like a parade. It looked like Jesus coming into the borough <laughs> and people waving their branches you know, and cheering on the Tecate driver. They were singing songs. It was just like Mexico. It's, I, I think it's a national holiday now. We actually are going to commemorate this every single year, the day that the coffee truck got back. Well, Pacifico, you know what, guys? If, if you can't find Pacifico, I got good news for you. It's all the same beer, different can. <laughs> the old man drank a beer every now and then. One day we cracked a couple, just me and him. At 80 years old, all the stories he could tell you. About his far-flung friends from France to Venezuela. 
said I swig Fosters with Aussies and Guinness in an Irish pub. A Shiner Bach and Lookin' Bach and Buddy, sure enough, it's all the same beer, different can. Just different labels, different brands. But the more you sip, the more you understand. It's all the same beer, different can. Our pal Tom Shepard played a tour overseas. Singing for all our folks stationed in the Middle East. At the ambassador's home right there in Riyadh. He sang a special song he'd written about his dad. And when the show was over, he was loading up his van. This guy walked up to Tom and stuck out his hand. He said, that song about your father really meant a lot to me. I just lost mine and you described him perfectly Now that man had on a white robe He wore sandals on his feet He had a gutra on his head And man, it ain't that hard to see We're all the same beer, different can Just different labels, different brands but the more you sit, the more you understand. We're all the same beer, different can. Now the old man said, I believe God's going to get a good laugh. But we learn all of us, Buds and Millers and Land Sharks and Coors and Tecates and Pacificos and even Pabst <laughs> are all the same beer, different can. Just different labels, different brands. But the more you sip, the more you understand we're all the same beer, different can. The more you sip, the more you understand. We're all the same beer, different can. Big thanks to Tom Shepard for co-writing that one. Well, you know what makes tonight really, really special? We got a couple of birthdays of viewers of the Mulligan's Island show. In fact, uh, mm -hmm. and guess what? One of them came all the way down here to be in our studio audience to celebrate his birthday. Brad, get up here. They need to see who you are. This is Brad. I love his last name. Brad Stoner. Yeah. Yeah, you know what, uh, Brad? Happy birthday! Thank you, Mark. Leslie. Come on up; they got to see you too. Come on up here. So, I've known these guys for a while, and in fact, I just got to sing for them this summer when Steve and Brenda Van Horn, who are watching this show, uh, hosted a show up there. Say hello to everybody. Hey, everybody. <laughs> so, stupid question: How is your birthday going in San Carlos? It's going great. It couldn't be worse place to spend it. <laughs> how about you, Leslie? Oh, we're having a good time. Good time. What have you guys been doing down here? Just soaking up the sun and the good beer and good yeah. food Enjoy. and enjoying the beaches. We brought some friends with us, so we love San Carlos. Well, very cool. Well, I'll tell you what, Leslie, you got you've got to help me sing this one. Get on over okay. here. Okay. We're gonna sing a song for Brad and Brad. Stay you just right enjoy. Here. Happy birthday to you, and we're so glad that you're spending it with us here. Everybody at home, sing along because Brad can hear you. One of my favorite songs goes just like this. Happy birthday to you. Get Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Brad. Happy birthday to you. Now hold on.
Hold on a second. We're going to do something real special. Leslie, I want just you to sing it for him. Oh, Come no. here. You can do it. No, no. Come on, Les. Can you do it? <laughs> no. Come on. I'll help you. I'll okay, help you. Okay. Get right on that mic. Okay. Okay. It, ladies and gentlemen, it's her, it's her big label <laughs> uh, debut right here. All right. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah. Are you ready? Yep. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Bradley. Happy birthday to you. Good job, yes. Good job, Leslie. <laughs> Happy birthday, yeah. Bradley. Yeah. Hey, man. Okay. We're, we're glad you're down here. Now. You know what? I'm going to need you guys to stay on deck because oh, yeah. after I sing a happy birthday to one more person, I need you guys to help me out on the song. And I might actually need uh, Pablo, el otro micrófono, a lo mejor me puedes pasar después de esta canción. We have another birthday of somebody who's watching us. And she's such a great, uh, great lady. Her name is Melinda. She used to live here in San Carlos many years ago and is a friend to many in the community. She just went from one beautiful place to another because she's now living in Molokai and uh, with her uh, friend over there, Mr. Wright. Now, I don't know. Are you seeing the picture of them? Hold on a second. I think you're going to see Mr. Wright in a second. There we are. There's Mr. Wright. Yeah, so hello to Melinda and Mr. Wright, and happy birthday, Melinda and Molokai. Uh, Mo uh, Melinda, I'd like to remind you that I do play house concerts. Just thought I'd throw that out there, Melinda, before I sing you happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Melinda. All right. We have a request for a song that I need you guys help on. And it's a tear-jerking, mushy, mushy song. So, Pablo, le puedes pasar el micrófono. And, Luis, can you take it Oh, Elaine and Michael are watching us up in the Northwest. Hi, Elaine and Michael. And uh, thanks for requesting this one because I'm going to get some help on it. Brad. One, two. We got it. Cool. So you guys are both going to. All I need is the guacamoles. Okay. Yeah, you guys can do that. Guacamoles. Yeah, and in fact, and in fact, if anybody in the studio audience would like to join them from behind them, you are unless you're running from the IRS and you can't be seen. <laughs> yeah. I'm living proof that the IRS doesn't watch this show. Thank God. We we're not big fans of them on Mulligan's Island. <laughs> All right. This one goes out for Michael and Elaine with a little help here from Brad and Leslie. Everybody ready for some guacamole? Repeat after me, guacamole. guacamole! Guacamole! Oh, we can do better than that. Guacamole! Guacamole! I met her at the Mercado. She was buying avocados. And man, she really turned me on. She reached for my pepper, and I grabbed her tomatoes. I knew it wouldn't take very long. To La Mesa, she picked up some cerveza, so I picked up some onions and limon. And the way she looked at me, man, I could clearly see that it wouldn't take very long. Guacamole! Guacamole! We'd be making guacamole all night long. Guacamole! Guacamole! We'd be making guacamole all night long. You know what I think we need on this song? I think we need a little help from your friends that you brought here tonight. Come on, guys. We need you up here. Come on, Idaho. Come on. Come on. We need you. You ready? Here they come. You got to be careful when you come sit in the studio audience, folks. I might just turn, turn the whole show over to you and go drink a rum and coke. Okay. She walked up to the line. I fell in right behind. And man, she sure looked good to me. She reached for her money. I said, wait a minute, honey. I believe this one is on me. We got in my pickup. We started to back up. We headed on down the road. We went into her casa. We ate tortillas de masa, and we made guacamole all night long. Guacamole, 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 
guacamole. Guacamole. We were making guacamole all night long. Guacamole. 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 We'd be making guacamole all night long. Here we go, guys. Guacamole. 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 Haciendo guacamole toda la noche. Guacamole. 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 We were making guacamole all night long. Guacamole. <laughs> Thank you guys and happy birthday, Bradley. <laughs> Pablo, I'm going to pass you this. Great job by the band. You guys want to go on the road? You, you guys ready for the big time? Yeah. My, my next show is in Eloy, Arizona. Yeah? <laughs> All right. Well, I always love it when you guys meet some of the hooligans. So the fellow hooligans is Rudy B. has named you guys who watch this show. Uh, you know, this is actually be probably a good time to show you something here that Rudy came up with. Hold on. So we all know that Rudy B. wrote the the song that uh, immortalized me after all these years of music. It's called The Ballad of Mark Mulligan. As you can guess, it's rapidly climbing the charts, uh, the hip-hop charts. And I'm just kidding, folks. Uh, this is a T-shirt that goes with the song, and it says "Mooligans, Hooligans, uh, Part Rock, uh, Part Hooligan, Part Rock Star." I love these shirts. Can you see that, Pablo? Oops, hold on. I love that. Thank you, Rudy, for the song and for the uh, shirts. We even got them in ladies' shirts here too. So uh, I'm going to the states, just so you know, on February the third. And if anybody wants to get one of these, I got the ladies' ones in pink and purple, turquoise or gray. And I got the men's ones in blue or gray. And I can actually ship when I go up to the United States because I don't get up there too often. But this is one of those rare times I can actually take advantage of it. If you want to order one uh, with the shipping and all their 25 bucks, just send me a note and send me your address and we'll fire off a shirt your way. Um, but hooligans that watch this show, it's fun to meet you guys and it's fun to have you meet each other. So I thought we'd introduce you to one. In fact, we're going to do this every single week. If uh, We're going to introduce you to one of the people who watched this show. Uh, there's a guy that's been watching this show from the very start. We've done, I think, like 80 episodes of this, and he's been there all along. And he loves to stump me. I think you guys know who I'm talking about here. He's watching us from Coburg, Ontario. And uh, Tom Copeland, Tom and Eleanor are up there watching along with their dog, Ellie. Everyone say hi to Tom and Ellie. And... Uh, we're going to introduce you to Tom right now. Apparently, the weather's not quite as nice right now in Ontario as it is here. Hola, all you hooligans. Greetings from the Great White North. This is uh, pretty much the worst snowstorm we've had here in our little neck of the woods in, uh, oh, probably... 10 or 15 years. I try to kick the habit, but it keeps on getting worse. Two days ago, you could see the all the uh, grass in the backyard, and now we've got about a foot and a half of snow just overnight. Give me some white sand, warm sun, and salt. Hope you're all staying well. Cheers. Intervention's useless. It's out of my control. The studio audience just took a vote, and we decided that you need some white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Am I right, guys? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Tom, for doing that. Got a constant craving. Can't fight the urge. Try to kick the habit, but it keeps on getting worse. I've given up on rehab. It's far too late. This lifelong addiction is impossible to break. Give me some white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. You know what, guys? This intervention's useless. It's out of my control. 12 steps from the ocean. Who needs 12 more? We 
Then you got white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. White sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Oh! I think Tom's warming up already. Now it goes back to my childhood, that very first trip. Watching the waves roll in, mesmerized this kid. By the time they dragged me up the beach and shoved me in the car, I knew no matter where I'd go, I'd never get too far. From white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Now the sea's outside my window. There's a beach outside my door. Those three things still turn me on, just like long ago. What are they, guys? White sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. White sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Oh! So keep your change of seasons, the winter and the cold. Send me a postcard with pictures of the snow. I'll look at it and shiver and just shake my head as I'm putting on my flip-flops and stepping out instead into the white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Ladies and gentlemen, Tom has just booked a one-way ticket to Mexico. Take all your sweaters and set them on fire. Slap on some sunscreen, put on some Kelly McGuire. Then turn around and run right to the place you ought to be. Get your butt into some beach chair down here with me. In white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Living by the sea is so good for the soul. I pinch myself and wonder who could ask for more than white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. There's no cure for this addiction. Every day I overdose on white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. White sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Oh! White sand, warm sun, and salty H2. Oh! Going out for Tom, Eleanor, and Ellie, way up north, currently shivering. We got to change that, Tom. Well, <clears throat> Tom, I'm going to send out a song that you requested. Tom always does like to stump me. He likes to go back into the archives and pull up some of the older songs. And I've got like 15 CDs. And so there's some of these songs that I haven't played in years. And uh, it's always kind of embarrassing when. Tom in Coburg, Ontario, knows my songs better than I do. Uh, but anyway, he'd like to hear this next one. Uh, make sure I do this in the right key. Okay, okay, Tom, you're not going to stump me on this one. All right. Um, appreciate the request on it. This is off the White Sand, Warm Sun, Salty H2O album. Makes me think of my kid, Monikos, when I pulled him out of school uh, for five, six days, and took him up the coast. Uh, I did this because he went through this phase where he had a gadget in his hand all the time, and he was disconnected from me, even though he was sitting right next to me. So we went up to this fishing village. This was my idea, and spent uh, just five, six days together where there's no internet, there's no phone, uh, there's no electricity, no water. Y you can imagine how excited my kid was to get to do this with his dad. But we really did have a good time. Uh, we did all kinds of things from uh, kayaking, going out on a ponga boat, uh, taught him how to spearfish, taught him how to drive. We went hiking. My favorite thing of all, though, was just simply getting a chance to talk to each other. And that's the name of this song. <laughs> Going out for Tom. 
by request. Staring at this inbox, staring back at me. I used to own this gadget, now this gadget owns me. Trying to answer all these messages is like holding back the time. Another wave comes rolling in by the time I hit reply. And then I wonder why can't we just talk to each other? Can't we just talk to each other? A real life conversation, is that too much to ask? Can't we just talk to each other? Now it seems like it's been ages since we sat and shot the breeze. Disconnected from devices, you and me. Now we shoot each other LOLs, but I'd rather share a laugh. Instead of likes on Facebook or pictures on Snapchat. Can't we just talk to each other? Can't we just talk to each other? One-on-one, -on -one, the two of us, the way we used to do. Let's talk to each other. Face to face and heart to heart, have we forgotten how? Hashtag done with this, I'm logging out. Is that my kid or just some alien, that zombie on the couch? Mesmerized by YouTube, sitting there for hours. When I finally snatch that iPad, he just rolls his eyes. I say, son, one day you'll thank me, now let's go outside where we can to each other, come on, let's talk to each other. One on one, the two of us, the way we used to do. Let's talk to each other. He says, Dad, you're so old fashioned. I just smile, but that's all right. Long as we can talk to each other. I love it when we talk to each other. Going out for Tom. Tom, thanks for watching every week like you have. Eleanor, thanks for putting up with me. Um, and hey, you know, this Meet the Hooligans thing, I'd love to introduce you if you're watching tonight. I'd love to introduce you to the other hooligans watching. So if you'd like to send us in the video and even just uh, introduce yourself, introduce your spouse, introduce us to your pet. I don't care. We'd love to meet your goldfish. Um, show us your house. Tell us something funny about your life. Make a song request, whatever you want to do. Tell us your favorite beer. We don't care. Just make it in interesting and exciting. Send me a video, and uh, we'll have fun with it and introduce you to the rest of the crowd. Next week, you're going to really enjoy the one that we got. I'm going to introduce you to somebody who is watching tonight. Her name is Leslie Salen. And Leslie is uh, kind of like Susan King, very storied here musically. She has really got a musical history with uh, Mamas and the Papas and uh, Chris Montez and just all kinds of little feet. And there's all kinds of cool stories she's going to share with us about her musical life uh, and even acting life before she got down here to San Carlos. And we got some cool pictures and video on our Meet the Hooligans, uh, Meet the Hooligans, Hooligans segment next week. You're going to meet Leslie Salem. I can't wait for that. So, uh, all right, Luis has been back there. He's been handling the comments. And by the way, Luis just had a birthday, as you guys know. He just turned 17 years old. Everybody give it up for Luis. You're supposed to go crazy when I say give it up for Luis. Yeah. Uh, so, anyway, he's been handling the comments. Luis, do we have any other requests back there? I think we had one more. Okay, and what was the one other than Tim's? Tim, I'm going to get yours in. And what was his? 
Okay, we, and we did that one. Jason, we got your request in. I hope you got to see that one. That's all that's left, right? I think that's it. All right, guys. Well, you know what? It's really been fun being back here uh, on, on Mulligan's Island. I want to thank Pablo and Anais. They've been doing the audio and the video tonight. Um, so, I mean, boy, she brought us back from that, that mouse that needed to be charged. That was heroic. The whole ship could have gone down. Thank you, Anais. <laughs> Heads are going to roll. No, I'm kidding. And thank you, Luis. Thanks to the studio audience. And thanks to the birthday boy, Bradley. Great to have you here, too. Leslie, thanks for getting up and joining us on singing him happy birthday, too. And um, So next week, I'll be back here again. Now that Monday night football is over, uh, we've moved the show back to Mondays, which is a day that works great for a lot of you guys. So uh, hopefully you'll let your friends know about it. We really thank you for your support. A lot of you guys have been really good on, on just uh, watching every week or bringing us new people or sending us pictures or tipping, which helps keep the show going. Thank you for doing that. Um, I'm looking forward already to next week. going to be a good time. This next song will close out here. Uh, going to close out with a song for Tim Scott, who's watching us in Illinois tonight. Tim escapes that cold every now and then and gets down here to San Carlos about once a year. And I know it's crossing his mind tonight. And he'd like to hear this song called Jesus Loves You. First you stiff the waitress. Then you slam the door. You backed into a Buick. And then you blew on down the road. I wonder what were you thinking as you took off down the block. Screaming like a madman and flipping people off. Just about then I thought I'd seen it all. Till I saw that big old sticker on the back of your car. And it said, Jesus loves me. And I did a double take. I can't speak for our Savior, but there's gotta be some mistake. Now this ain't from the gospel. No, you won't hear this at church. Yeah. Jesus loves you. The rest of us think you're a jerk. Maybe you just woke up on the wrong side of the bed. So you're having a bad day, huh? Well, get over it. Maybe your mama didn't love you. Your gal dumped you or the job is driving you insane. Go ahead, shout out to the Lord, but quit screaming his name in vain. There you go, cussing out the traffic cop. I bet God's looking down, begging you to please shut up. As you say, Jesus loves me. Dude, I, I've actually got some doubts. Take a good look at the good book. This ain't what it's all about. Now here's a revelation. Take it for what it's worth. Yeah. Jesus loves you. The rest of us think you're a jerk. Can you guess where I did the editing in the song? He said he came for sinners. And you're his kind of guy. But now I look into the mirror. And my God, I realize. Who am I fooling? Thinking I'm better than you. Yeah, Lord, forgive me. I know not what I do, because just like you, I say, Jesus loves me, and I know that's true. Even when I don't get just what he sees in you. Okay, and I point my finger like you're the big sinner when I just might be the worst. Hey, thank God. Jesus loves me, even when I'm a jerk. Now I hope we both make it to heaven. I just pray you get there first. <laughs> Jesus loves you. One more time, because it's true, everybody. Jesus loves you. Hey, gang, let's just leave it at that. <laughs> All right, guys, before you tune out, don't tune out, because I got I to gotta tell you something. We always close with a theme song. And as you guys know, a lot of you are featured in that. You can send in your picture, and you can be part of the theme song. But we're making it even more fun. Uh, we're going to, in two weeks, we're going to have you guys sing the theme song from wherever you are. 
So here's what I need you to do. If you would like to sing a line from the song, like sing it into your phone and send it to us, I need you to send a note to Rudy B. He's watching tonight, and uh, Rudy will send you the song so that you can sing along to it, like in your headphones, and record yourself. Even if you're like Tom Copeland standing in the snow, you can, you can uh, record a line to the song. We'll put you, your video, and your voice, and you will be in the closing theme song of the show. And we figured every week we'd interchange and get some different people in there too. But you might be in there for a while, depending on how many people do this. So send us you singing a line, your favorite line from the song. Rudy B would love to get you in there. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, next week, we actually have a special guest who is going to sing the closing theme song. And it's really, really cool. I'm not going to sing it next week. I'm sorry, Rudy won't be singing it. It's a special guest, and you're going to love it. Rudy, thanks for all the work you do on the theme song. Also, I want to thank Rudy because if you live in the Phoenix area, he's going to be hosting a house concert Saturday, February the 5th. It's an afternoon show uh, beside the lake in Abatuki. House concert where you, we get together an hour before the show, and we mingle, we have fun, happy hour. Then we sit, and you can actually hear the lyrics in a show like this. Uh, everyone brings their own drinks, brings their own chair, bring your own munchies. It's a 1 p.m. show overlooking the water in Abatuki, hosted by Rudy B. If you would like to go, make sure you send me a note, send Rudy a note. We'll send you all the details about it. Love to see my Phoenix friends on Saturday, February the 5th at uh, the house concert hosted by Rudy B. And, of course, he's going to be playing lead guitar. And if you haven't seen Rudy B, he's absolutely incredible. So, speaking of Rudy B., Let's have him take us out of here with the closing uh, theme song from Mulligan's Island. Everybody, God bless you, and thanks for a great night. It's been fun, and it's great to be back with you again. Let's make our way down to Mexico. Friends we know White sand, warm sun And H2O It's time for us to get back To laid back Try a different beer From our favorite six pack This crazy world says Come on, let's go It's time for the music man A coastal kid With guitar in hand even bad days are good here on the island Giving us a place where we can Talk to each other fan to fan Uncharted courses crossing our paths It's our kind of people And our kind of place It's a Mexican hideaway The life in this old beach town Turns a frown upside down We all be smiling Here on Mulligan's Island It's the right place and the right time To be south of the border again this is the day we get to listen in We don't sing no blues anymore We kick off our shoes at our front door Full of wide-eyed wonder as the waves roll in It's time for the music man A coastal kid with guitar in hand even bad days are good here on the island Giving us a place where we can Talk to each other fan to fan Uncharted courses crossing our paths It's our kind of people And our kind of place Mexican hideaway Life in this old beach town 
turns a frown upside down. We all be smiling here on Mulligan's Island. We all be smiling here on Mulligan's Island. <laughs>